Speaking out against the Pakistani military has made her an enemy of the government. London-based activist Gul Bukhari has been summoned by Pakistan's federal agencies and threatened with terror charges if she fails to respond. Now, Vion, World is One's ex executive editor, Palki Sharma Upadhyay, spoke to Gul Bukhari about the summon issued to her and why she thinks the Pakistani government is after her. Listen in to this Vion exclusive. Uh, you've been accused of inciting violence, spreading hatred, maligning the government of Pakistan and creating divisions in Pakistan. What did you do to invite such charges? There was this issue about an FIA notice to me. Right. Uh, in which they had, uh, I think, said that they sent me a notice and that I would have to appear before them. And if I didn't, then they would bring charges of terrorism and also some cyber crimes against me. So uh, you do know that the government, in whatever form, is is initiating some action against you. What do you propose to do about yes, it? Yes. Well, I will do something about it once I get a notice from them, the FIA or anybody. There is absolutely nothing I can do uh, unless I'm served with a notice, right? So they ran it on the news that they've served, that they've served me a notice. So I will take them to court if they serve it. I will not respond to the FIA. Why do you I think mean, you're being targeted? Uh, to be honest, I'm not sure. Um, they've just gone nuts, basically. They can't handle dissent. I think there's, there's a lot that goes on within the military. And they keep it hush-hush. I get news of it. And... I let people know about it, things that they want to keep secret. Uh, that could be it. Otherwise, there's nothing that I've done recently or anything. So you know that uh, dissent and the press in, in Pakistan is not tolerated beyond a point. I'm sure you've seen the atmosphere. Uh, were you yes. never worried that it will come to this? Or did you take this into account while saying whatever you were saying online? No, no, no. Nobody could have... I could not have imagined that it would come to this, that they'd start hounding me and um, slapping charges and talking about confiscation of property and involving the Interpol and charging me with terrorism and stuff. I mean, this is crazy. This is absolutely unimaginable. Nobody can imagine some a government would be... <clears throat> would, would stoop to this, you know?